The issue of building safety and fire safety is very important to my residents in Reading and I wanted to mention a few points that relate to local matters but also to ask the Minister some brief questions as well if I may. Um, I have to say that in the years since Grenfell I have been constantly reminded and aware of the awful briefing that I had from Royal Berkshire Fire and Rescue immediately after the tragedy which was sobering and really quite something that will stay with me for many, many years. And what I was told at that time was the scale of the problem in our county, not just in Reading, but in other towns like Slough and Wokingham and Bracknell. And what I heard from the fire service was really quite incredible. The, the scale of the problems that they were uncovering and the really serious threat to human life that was caused by building safety issues. To give you an idea of some of the problems, um, and some of these relate to both cladding but other issues as well, they explained to us about the holes they discovered in what should be safe partition firewalls, the dangerous cladding that existed in buildings across the county, the fact that it was going to take them a very long time to carry out assessments across the whole, and this is just one English county across the whole of our county, to fully understand the level of risk that's both to residents in um, taller buildings and some, as some honourable members have mentioned earlier today, some lower rise flats as well, which are below the, um, the limit that's been set on for some of the measures that have been taken and indeed other problems like wooden cladding, um, poorly designed um, fire doors, uh, the need for waking watches, the incredible work that then followed obviously to, uh, to carry out those measures over a number of years. And um, it's been a huge, it's, it's taken a huge amount of work locally and I'm sure across the country to try to tackle some of this awful legacy. And there's been really quite significant delays as well in addressing much of this. Much of the problems obviously um, were uncovered some years ago, but under the previous government's watch, it took a very, very long time to tackle much of this. And my own residents were left for several years in many cases, waiting in more often uh, either privately owned or housing association blocks, waiting for remediation. So I do welcome the ministers, uh, the measures the minister outlined today to speed up some of this work and continue to press forward.